a holiday tradition at my house was always the decorations. We were always that house on the street where someone would ask me, where do you live? And I would say, well, you know that Christmas house? And they would say, oh, you're that house. Because I'm Norwegian, my family's been making Norwegian meatballs. And so we all get together and with my sisters and my aunts and everybody, and we all make the meatballs and then we bring them to our family party. And we've been doing it ever since I was a little girl. My entire family gets together, like aunts, uncles, nieces, nephews. We start off with my uncle making a big, giant pot of gumbo. After gumbo, we all do karaoke, and it gets a little crazy. We've actually had the police called on us because it's a full-on party. Ever since I was a kid, our tradition for the holidays is making tamales, and my favorite are the chile verde. After our holiday meal, we gather around the couch and we sing ABBA karaoke. My grandma and I, we do this cute number together when we sing Dancing Queen. My family and our friends um, carry hot chocolate through Candy Cane Lane. My Christmas tradition is incredibly untraditional. I have a big, huge Christmas Eve party where I invite friends and family, but I pick a theme by country, and then everything's wrapped around that theme of the country, all the food, the entertainment, and my tree tops it off. My family gets matching jammies, and we all watch Elf on a big screen outside under the stars. So I'm recently engaged to someone from the Netherlands and it's just been wonderful getting to learn his family traditions and being able to blend them with my family's traditions. Each year my dad hides a pickle ornament on the tree. It's a German tradition, my family is German. I usually am the one to find it, um, but every once in a while my brother or my sister does. <laughs> we like to take basically theme photos. Last year, we, our theme was basically Abbey Road. The reason why we chose that is because we were all going in different directions in our lives at that time. And so this was to basically mark the journey. Every Christmas Eve, my brother and I would be itching to open a gift. And so my parents would let us open each other's gifts. So I would open the gift from my brother and he would open the gift from me. And actually, even now that we're adults, we carried the tradition on. It's my daughter, Gigi's first Christmas. We're gonna start a brand new tradition and we're gonna wear matching pajamas as a family Christmas morning. Our entire family has Christmas dinner on Christmas Eve and we literally, everybody stays up till midnight to open presents. Everybody from the oldest to the youngest, literally, even though they're grouchy. Every year with my four kids, we bake gingerbread houses. My only tradition when I was a kid was to um, go to bed the night before Christmas very early because I wanted to wake up very early in the morning. And my duty was to run into everybody's bedrooms and scream to everybody, baby Jesus is born, the toys are here, the gifts are here, wake up, wake up, we have to open our gifts. Now that I have my own family and I uh, have my son, I'm waiting for him to be able to run around and wake us up on Christmas morning so we can start the tradition with him.